Today I'd like to revisit an old video that I made um, to my updated day hiking kit. Uh, one of my videos that I made, when I, actually my first video that I made, it was uh, what I carry in my day hiking kit. Um, it's a good run through of everything that I carry. I don't carry much, but it's just enough to, you know, to hike in the woods. So uh, let, let's open up the kit and check it out. So this is my kit that's in my pack. Uh, it weighs probably around like six pounds. Not even that. Uh, once I add water to it, it's a little heavier. And this is only, I only use this for day hiking. I go out in the woods and just walk the trails. The pack that I use is a Hidden Woodsman Day Ruck. With, I have two little pouches on the side. One is for my compass and the front one is for my bandana. And I keep little snacks in the front. I carry a little bag for trash or if I find a little tinder or things like that, I can pick up. I carry a 100% cotton bandana. I carry a small fire kit, which includes uh, in the Altoids tin, there is uh, petroleum jelly and um, cotton balls, a little Bic lighter and a ferro rod, and they all fit in that little pouch. I have some natural fire material, if in case I get wet or something happens to me, I need to start a little fire. Um, I have a little pine pitch and cedar sticks and some fat wood in there. I carry a little toilet kit with some Purell and some baby wipes and a little bit of toilet paper. I have a first aid kit. Uh, pretty much it covers everything from burns, cuts, scrapes, insect bites. Um, there's some duct tape in there in case I need it for anything. I also have a little compass with a whistle on the side attached to it and the compass does have a mirror in case I need to look at my face or I need to signal for, for help or anything like that. I have a little uh, 500D Kodora um, uh, pad that I usually just kneel on or, or I can sit on it so I don't get wet. And that little bush crap strap there is for uh, hanging my pack from a tree or if I need to attach anything to the bottom of my pack. Now these items stay at the bottom of my pack that I do not take out. They are just there for emergency uses. I have a small uh, small food kit that has you know just enough food to get me for a, uh, you know, a day or two if I, if I need to for emergencies if it happens to me. Uh, for a small emergency shelter I have a reusable mylar blanket that will uh, I can use as a cover to keep the rain off me. Two stakes, a garbage bag that I can lay on the ground or I can add leaves to it or something to make like a insulated to insulate the ground and then I have that SOL um, bivy this thing's pretty cool it's like pretty much like a sandwich mylar blanket that you can crawl up in so just with that stuff I can stay out of the rain and I can last the, a few nights out here in an emergency I keep a fixed blade knife with me it's a, it's a more robust I usually only carry 40 ounces of water um, I have a stainless steel GSI cup with a clean canteen, 40 ounce uh, container. It's steel too so that I can boil in both of them if I need to boil more water. I also carry a, a little little pocket bible in case I want to do some reading. I also bring a Laplander, a Baco Laplander saw. Uh, this helps me if there's any debris in the trails that I can clear the trails out for other hikers or if I need to um, get some quick firewood. I can easily saw up with a saw. Inside this little bag I have various items. Uh, an extra lighter. Uh, that little, this little case here has spare batteries for my headlamp. I have a little tiny roll of duct tape. I got some extra cordage. I keep an orange cordage there to help mark the trails. Some of the trails are unmarked and I'd like to, uh, to mark them because where I go a lot of mountain bikers go and there's some steep, steep trails so if there's not a marker there and they're not paying attention they can easily go off the side of the trail and get pretty hurt, so I try to mock the trail so that they can keep them safe. I have a roll bank line, and I have a little little sharpening stone in case my knife gets dull for whatever reasons. So that's my my, that's my day hiking kit. Uh, I carry this stuff, like I said, I, just when I go into the woods to go hiking. I don't really, I, you know, it's just to walk the trails and just to have a, some emergency stuff. Um, I've learned over years of hiking that you don't need a lot of stuff. A lot of people like to load their packs up just to go hiking and. It actually takes away from the hike because you know it wears you down more. Um, 
So the lighter you can go, the, and just the, just the stuff you need, it actually makes the woods more enjoyable. So I hope uh, this helped you, and I hope that you can uh, get, get your kit together and go into the woods and, and have, a, have a good time. So thanks, guys, and have a good day.